Yo, what's up, family? Y'all know what today is. Y'all know whose birthday it is today, man. Of course. It's the king. The king. The goat. The legend. Yeah. Bat. G Dragon. G to the D. Gold and diamonds. Gold and diamonds, man. Just like the album made gold G -O -D. to diamond it's gonna go diamond just wait wait on it but look we got who are you who are you this has been requested about 150 billion times who are you who are you who are you you who remember that drink remember that drink you it's who? a very good drink it was gross it was pretty gross come on it is kind of gross. I think I just it like pretty chocolate gross. milk, so I just convinced myself that it's It didn't even taste like chocolate milk, right? <laughs> no, it it was like some it has other, an odd taste. It does. Some other thing. Uh, yeah, Nesquik gang. No, actually, no. Screw Nesquik. Screw Nest till. Doesn't Nesquik uh, Nes Nesquik? slave children? Yes, they do. So, who you, GD? This is live from SBS. Uh, September 22nd. Let's see what year. How old was I? 2013. I was a sophomore. A mere lad. A mere lad. Young lad. <laughs> sophomore. That was actually when we started dating. That is. Not September though. It His was history. It was the half. Well, I'm, the I mean, half like of the year. To sophomore. It was like. Yeah. It, it was, was a very short like March. Short lived uh, April? vibe. Yeah, it was a vibe. April. It was a vibe? It was a short That's all it was? I said it was a short lived vibe. Yeah. It was a vibe. We don't, we don't talk about we don't, we don't get into that. We don't talk about that. Lots of mistakes. <laughs> I'm not saying shy was a mistake. I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, never mind. By the way, shout out to my mom. She got me this hat for my birthday. I wanted a new gray one. <laughs> he got it. <laughs> Thanks, mommy. I love you. Um. But yeah, it was my birthday. About a week ago. A week ago. Fuck with us and then we tweaking, ho. Tweaking, ho. Run up on that nigga, get to squeezing, ho. Squeezing, ho. Happy late birthday to me. If you want to wish me happy late birthday, go ahead. Down in the comments. Go to ahead. the daddy of this it's channel. Okay. We only have one daddy. And that is Charles. I am technically a daddy, but we won't get into that. Yeah, she's my daddy. <laughs> um, King daddy. But, dab, hold up. I got to say... What's good to the gang, to the family, to the crew, you, the critiquer. Click, click. So we're going to start with this live and then we're going to jump into the music video with a bunch of VIPs apparently. Happy birthday, bro. Congrats. Dope birthday. Love you. It all killed my a good vibes. Man's trying to start a trend with one button up here. <laughs> this man is always starting trends. Yeah. Are there two buttons? I think it's two buttons. Yeah. 
시장 나 주누구 놀려 어머 앵간 니 조매라 자리에서 피난 상에 덜어본 게나 내가 너에게 못 사준 비싼 베개 구두 대신 사버린 눈물 젖은 베개 왜 너는 꼭 해보 난 무리에 야난 건데 세니가 먼데 See our reference right there? You seen that? What do you say? I'm on the Gigi Bay. Nah. Yo. 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 Let's watch him get this W. Oh. 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 Big dog. Oh, he's coming back for more. Big dog. I'm sure you said thank you. I can tell you that. Now, before we hop into this music video, I want to talk about this song sonically, just from that live. I think the hook sounds really catchy. Like you have a piano and you have this choppy flow. You have like. Uh, two syllables and then a pause. So, baby, pause. Did he say, who you there? He says something like that. Who you, pause, piano. I think that's really catchy. We got a thousand fans in this music video. So, if you were one of these thousand fans, let me know down below in the comments. You're blessed. <laughs> <laughs> I'm jealous. Yeah. Let's dive. Hold on, JD. We we rocking the hat backwards. All right, I got you. I got you. It's your birthday. You make the rules. nice to do for his fans and put them all in the video baby love you you duck my g man mama when g i'm not no judge i'm not it's almost like he's saying i love you to the fans right we'll jump into the lyrics after this want you i need you know that booty g man i don't know i feel bad Now, 
Pass. So that's part of the choreo. He like moves his legs to the drum roll. That's pretty cool. And uh, I'm thinking, how many times did he do this? You know, I'm sure yeah. he performed the song at least like five times. Yeah. You know, to get a bunch of different shots. way to leave your music video shoot oh my yeah. god you can just get in your lambo and get out of here literally goes to the street that's sick Yeah, I think so. <laughs> 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 Where are these oh, people? The are those the fans? Wow. Wow, that's so nice. Dude, imagine seeing your name in this video. And she needs your life, man. Like, this is... This is so nice. Wow. This is vibing. 
of charisma in this man. Mm-hmm. I love this track. Yeah. It's like a really good vibe. It is. And it has like a a rock sound to it. Right. It has more of like this kind of pop rock sound to it. And I like it. Yeah, Baby, I really do like it. Want you. It's the same thing with Crooked, like a rock sound to it. And his verse sounded good, so let's check out these lyrics. So lyrics by GD, composed by Kush and GD, and arranged by Kush and Choice. Not surprised. So the hook goes, baby, I love you. I say this, but I don't feel good at all. I want you, I need you. I sing, but I don't know why I feel bad. What are you? So it's pretty obvious to tell here that he loves somebody and has romantic feelings for them. But thinking about the music video, when he says, baby, I love you. I say this, but I don't feel good at all. I want you, I need you. I sing, but I don't know why I feel bad. What are you? Think about that directed towards the fans. Like how the fans, he loves the fans and he needs the fans. He wants the fans. But sometimes the fans don't make him feel good. They give him anxiety or they give him depression because of all the pressure. It's not because of the love, but because of the pressure, just having, just from having an enormous amount of people love you and look to you. Is a lot of pressure. Mm-hmm. So I feel like there's some sort of meaning there with the hook and the music video. And then he says, congratulations, you're already meeting someone new. I hope it works out, although it's a bit early. If you're happy, that's all I want, but I keep getting angry, baby. So what are you? I like how he keeps saying, what are you? Like, not who are you, just what are you? Okay, so what we know now is that GD and this person that he's talking about are exes. They're not together anymore. And this person is meeting somebody new. And GD, he wants that to work out for her or for him because he wants them to be happy. But uh, I keep getting angry. So what are you? So like he wants them to be happy, but he's getting angry that this person is with somebody else. So he's starting to get jealous. So he still has feelings. Throughout this entire track, he says baby and then something else. So in the beginning, it's baby, I love you. And then later on, it's baby, I miss you. And then at the end, baby, I hate you. Baby, I loved you with the D. So let's catch up to that spot. In the next verse, he's got baby, I miss you. Why do I keep thinking about you? I can't meet someone else. I don't want to. Whether I love you or hate you, I can't determine. Every day I'm still confused. I don't know why I feel bad. What are you? You keep showing up in front of me with your arms locked to his. This isn't right. Are you kidding me? Oh my, enough is enough. A pair of dirty flowers bloom by the street. Instead of the expensive purse that I couldn't get you, instead of shoes, I bought a pillow wet with tears. Why are you happy while I'm unfortunate? So what, so what you, so what are you? I'm sure is what mm-hmm. that means to say. Pretty self-explanatory, this yeah. whole track. It's pretty uh, easy to I tell. I want you back. Yeah, and he's heartbroken. It's your typical heartbroken track, pretty much. But what's not typical is how, but what's not typical is how the hook is set up. Because each time when the hook comes back, it's not, the same set of lyrics. It's the same melody, but it's baby and then something else. After that hook and then doo doo doos, we got baby, I just want you back. I want you back. Baby, I know it's too late. It's just too late. And then after that, you got I pray for a fight, pray for a breakup. I always pray for you to come back to me. So a fight between her and her new man. Yeah. Every neighborhood's, every streets. So every neighborhood or every street I visit and tell people that you two aren't doing well. So lame and loserish. I've always been a loser. I didn't know you're the same. You bad girl. I will treat you better. Will you meet me? I won't bother you. Will you please come back to me? But then after that, it's baby, I hate you. Baby, I loved you. My baby hate you. Baby, love you. What are you? So he hates her 
and he loves you. That's why it's what are you? How can I hate you and how can I love you at the same time? Right. I think we've all been there. Yeah. <laughs> well, you, th you thinking about me? You yeah. You thinking about how you used to hate and love me at the same time? <laughs> Pretty much. I'm sorry. <laughs> you know this. <laughs> the way this song is written and done, <laughs> just like the development of the hook, how it changes each time, and all of the mixed emotions from G-Dragon and how relatable it all is. Nothing here seems unrelatable. And the melody, just how it sonically sounds, this whole song put together, it's, it's beautiful. It's a good track, it's a great track. I can tell that this is gonna be a song that if it comes on, I'm gonna let it play. I'm thinking at the end when he says I didn't know you're the same you bad girl is that when he does the now nah, I'm from Gigi Bay that's when he does that <laughs> maybe because in that song she's saying the baddest female right so that's what he's saying right you bad girl is, is that you say that the same way you bad girl you baddest female the concept of I love you and I hate you what are you that's just a cool, cool concept. It's not who are you, what are you? Like, what does that make you? If I love you and I hate you, what does that make you to me? It reminds me of that song by Tyler the Crater. I fucking hate you, but I love you. I fucking hate you, but I love you. I'm bad at keeping my emotions bubbled. You know that song? No. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for critiquing with us in GD. Dope birthday, bro. Congrats. Yes, happy birthday. Congrats. Woo! Uh, one of these days, we're going to see you live, bro. It's yeah. It's going to be a great experience. Can't wait for the comeback, man. We're waiting on it. We're yes. waiting on it. Slide us um, those free tickets. Yes, yeah, slide us the demo of the song you're about to drop. Before it comes out, slide us the demo. All right? We won't you, tell. We won't you can tell see anything. my gram. You, you see the Instagram? Come on. We won't show anyone any music that you show us. Oh, you can trust us. You can show you it can to us, us first. Don't worry. They will never know. I I swear, bro. Like, we'll keep it safe. Shut up. Shut up. And send us some pe go. penis. Oh, God. What the fuck? I was going to say peace minus one gear. Uh, penis minus one gear? And send us some peace minus one gear. Oh, yeah, that, that'd be cool. I'm not going to ask for things on his birthday. Yeah. Crazy, yeah. We love you. You stay classy, critic. Out. Shy. Out. <laughs>